Today in front of me I have Lenovo Tab M10 Plus and in this video we would like to demonstrate that you can enable and set up the parental controls on this device. Alrighty, so first of all you have to launch settings, then enter the Google category. In here make sure that no accounts are currently associated with your system, if they are some just remove them, unlink them. After that, after this step has been successfully executed, tap on the parental control section over here, get started, child or teenager, next. Now we will wait for a little bit. In here, go for the add or create account for a child. If you already have an account prepared, just log in. If not, sign up nothing really hard at this point uh, it is also worth mentioning which can be obvious but still the child has to not know the password to this account since if they will they will be able to very easily bypass the parental controls so in here in here I'll enter the email uh, to the Google account that will be used as the child's one so hard reset info game going next then I'll uh, enter the password to it off the screen of course So you have answered both credentials, tap on the I agree button, then more, accept, in here choose the account that we have just logged into from the list, then you have to also enter the credentials, thus email and password for the parents account or the Google account that will be further used to supervise the child's activity, so I will once again, enter the email. <clears throat> then the password of the screen. Once this, this step has been done, uh, you can learn more about the supervision process, what you will be capable of doing. Scroll the page all the way down. Uh, do not be freaked out. You will not have as many devices as uh, I do and well, by the matter of fact, you will, shouldn't have any if that's your first time setting this feature up, but I mean, it's not that important at this point. Just scroll the page all the way down until you'll find this very section. In order to confirm the uh, account link and procedure, enter the password to the child's account once again. And after you will type it in, just tap on the agree button. After that, you'll get this little dialog window, which you want to tap allow on, wait until those accounts will be linked, then click on next. In here you can uh, manage some or well a lot of apps so turn and turn them on or off but if you uh, you can absolutely do that later so if you would like to uh, finish the setup quicker just skip the step click on next right away. The same goes for the following page that will provide us with an opportunity to uh, set up and uh, change some content restrictions and filters for content. So I'll click on next. In here uh, at the manage parental controls page, uh, see whether the device that is written in the bold font is the one that you'll use uh, as a parent or as a supervisor. If it is uh, correct, tap on the install family link button and the needed app will be automatically downloaded and installed on your parent's device. If not, you can just skip uh, this inst automatic installation and finalize the setup procedure manually. So basically everything that needed to be done at the child's end well, were done. So. Uh, now take the device that you will use for supervising. I have this little Simpson tablet in front of me. Uh, how do I make it so you'll see everything? Mm. Let me put it in the landscape mode. So at your parent's device, open the, first of all, enter the uh, supervisor's Google account, type, uh, link it to the system, then enter the Google Play Store, type in the family, link, query, then download this very app, mm. 
Now you can just go ahead and launch the Google Family Link application. In here, you'll probably get some uh, instructions or well, greetings page or whatever. First of all, let it get loaded since the tablet I have is, <laughs> to be honest, on the uh, well, weak performance hand, so it might take some time, but we'll wait, I guess. Have nowhere to ho hurry for. probably need to relaunch the family link or whatever oh here it is uh, from the list make sure to choose the uh, account the google account that you have uh, uh, well, identified as your parents account so here it is in my case after everything gets well properly loaded i'll be able to show you what you can do with it with your parental controls how you can manage, see, and well, so change pretty much the child's activity and restrict it if needed, of course. Still, we have to wait until everything gets loaded properly since well, this tablet sucks. In here, as you can see, we have our Lenovo M10 Plus tablet set up. Um, you can configure the daily limits for the device usage, set a downtime, downtime routine, uh, configure and monitor the app limits as well as app activity, apply content restrictions, configure the account settings, and manage devices. Alrighty, so that would be it as far as the, as far as setting up the parental controls for this tablet <coughs> goes. We highly appreciate your attention. Thanks for watching and bye-bye.